Hi my dear Librans, what's up? I hope you're doing fantastic, fantabulous, rocking as usual. This is Luna the Moon Tarot. Today we will be doing your April 2022 reading. Let's see what is in store for you in the month of April. This is for my dear Librans for the month of April here. So let's see what is it that my liberal needs to know for the month of April 2022 here. What is it that my liberal needs to know? Oh, heart to heart conversation. Honestly, discuss your feelings with each other. You have been guided to discuss your feelings whatsoever you are feeling right now. You have been asked to discuss your feelings and have a heart to heart conversation and keep an open mind, open mind your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations so you've been asked to keep an open mind because your soulmate may differ from your usual star usual type right so just keep an open mind let's see what is it that we what is the guiding message what is the guidance message that we have for my dear Libran for the month of April? Just give me one card. What is the guidance message that we have for my dear Librans here? This is for my dear Librans for the month of April 2020. What is the guidance message that we have for my dear Librans for the month of April 2022? What is the guidance message? Okay. Remain positive. not the right time you've been asked to remain positive as it is not the right time for now but then yeah there is something that you've been asked and you've been guided to just be positive do not make any move because right now it is not the right time right so let's start with your reading here let's see what uh, what does the tarot card has to say Again, I, uh, you know, by the end, I would be pulling out your uh, messages for full moon. For, you know, what are your messages for full moon as well by the end of this reading? March full moon by the end of this reading. And at the end, I will be also pulling out the messages from your person. So stay tuned. Do remember that the time is fluid. It may may not resonate with each and every one of you but then do remember that you know if it is not resonating with you right now it may do later also uh, do uh, do not uh, try and deliberately fit into this particular reading as you know it may not resonate do check out your sun, moon, rising, Venus, Jupiter signs as well before you leave. Do leave a feedback in the comment section. And if you are looking for a personal reading from me, do hit me up on my Instagram page. I am posting daily pick a pile, pick a card on my Instagram. The link is in the description below. You can also message me if you're looking for a personal reading. The prices and everything is mentioned on Instagram. You can definitely check that out and do a okay. Great. So the first card which just fell off, oh, just fell on the floor. So I'm just going to pick it up quickly. The first card is the Justice card. Libran, this is your card. Definitely. Um, I think you're trying to. Uh, you are kind of trying to balance your life out here for a few of you maybe even going through a karmic connection or some kind of legal issues in your life which will be sorted out in your favor for some of you i'm hearing that but i feel that probably you are going through some kind of a karmic connection here which is carry forward from your past life here that's why you've been asked to remain positive and do a heart to heart conversation right and let's see what else do we have for my deliverance what is it that my deliverance needs to know for the month of april 2022 what is it that my deliverance needs to know here 
for the month of April 2022. What is it that my librarians needs to know here for the month of April 2022? This is for my general space. What is it that my librarians needs to know? Okay. I see judgment. I see the magician. Librarians, I feel that somewhere down the line. Oh, did you see that? All the major arcanas here, librarians. All the major arcanas we have here. Oh my god. Just look at this. Just look at this. We have justice, we have magician, and we have judgment here. I feel, Librans, that there is something uh, you are manifesting in your life right now. And you are manifesting like crazy. There is some kind of balance. There is some kind of karmic connection that has come and, hit, and it has hit you hard. It has hit you hard. And there is some kind of a judgment probably that, you know, you are coming to. Probably for few of you, I am also hearing that the person that you are dealing with you are looking for a second chance with your person here. Let's see. There is some kind of judgment that you are going, you you are taking right now. But then there is a lot of manifestation that is involved. For few of you, I also feel that you feel that you, you know, your person is too good to be true again. Librans, what's happening? Your world is changing. Your dynamics and your relationships are changing. Whatever do not serve your higher purpose. You are moving on. You are leaving things behind. And there is a new, new uh, phase of your life. There is a new breakthrough which is coming in in the month of April, dear Librans. April is going to be hot and heavy and a lot of realization, a lot of manifestation, a lot of direction, clarity and a lot of... Uh, energies that you are leaving behind which do not serve you anymore there is a lot of clutter clearing <laughs> or relationship clearing that you are doing so there will be people you will be leaving behind old friendships do, that do not serve you well anymore you know automatically they are going out from your life and only those people are going to stay in your life who are serving the higher purpose for you who are serving the higher purpose for you definitely right amazing april is going to be quite a roller coaster ride but then uh, in a good way in a good way let's see what else do my liberal needs to know here what else my liberals should know here what is it that my liberals needs to know what is going to happen in the month of April here? What is it? Librans, what's going on? The star, wish fulfillment. So whatever you've been manifesting, probably you can be even dealing with uh, an air sign here, Gemini Libra Aquarius. Apart from that, I also see that there is a wish fulfillment. So whatever you've been manifesting here, remember? Whatever you've been manifesting here, it is going to happen. It is going to happen. So decide what you really want. Because April is the month wherein you will be getting everything. You will be getting the clarity. You will be getting your wish fulfillment. So decide what you really want and start manifesting. April is the month of wish fulfillment for you all. What else do we have for my genetics here? This is for my dear Librans, April 2022. What else do we have for my dear Librans here? What else do we have for my dear Librans here? I feel Librans that, you know, April is a lot of realization, a lot of epiphanies, a lot of breakthroughs which is going to come in your way and i also see queen of cups here i feel that you are being very emotional towards a person towards your person 
you are you know when it comes to your emotions whatever things that are that you are going through in the month of april you are definitely missing your person here and that is where you've been asked to do a heart to heart conversation and i feel that you know you've been asked to remain positive because a good outcome is going to come okay what is it that is going uh, will what is it that will happen in my living's love life please tell me what is it that is that will happen in their love life oh my god so if you see this so the i feel that once you do all the clutter clearing here librans you know when the world will change all your connection all your connection which doesn't serve your higher purpose is going or oh, you know going out of your life there is a lot of clarity there is a lot of breakthrough that is going to come in in your life that is when you know things will take a better turn i'm so sorry a car just fell down and i'm trying to pick it up okay yeah, just damaged it wow there is a lot of cut clutter clearing and everything will happen there is a wish fulfillment that is coming there is an out you know there is an outbreak in the con communication that is going to come in with your person and that is when you are going to do a heart to heart conversation just right here as i said your wish fulfillment will come true and 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 there will be a lot of emotional exchange and i see two of cups here a soulmate connection a reunion in case if you guys are going through a separation or no contact period but a soulmate connection and the partnership it is the partnership will start i think you guys once you have a heart to heart conversation that is when you know things are going to become clear and everything is going to start or fall in the right direction for you people yeah so a uh, love a beginning of love that is your wish fulfillment a lot of emotional exchange but then i feel that right now uh, probably you may even have some choices in love or people that you are kind of confused or probably you just daydreaming about your person you kind of dreaming how you should approach Uh, when you should approach and what will happen yes and there is lot of back and forth communication for few i feel that you might be even traveling towards your person here right a lot of back and forth communication it is going to happen fast you're going to travel fast there is lot of daydreaming there is lot of illusion that you have around yourself or about this person but then definitely you de definitely for few of you i see there's a choice as a third party as well probably you're leaving one going to the next but then there's a lot of party involved there's a lot of uh communication involved there's a uh, choice or decision or judgment which is involved a uh, new direction which is involved and you're going to end a relationship with one person and enter into another one which serves your higher purpose right that's what i feel because we have world card at the at the back we have a judgment here so i feel in case whatever choices you had probably you had two people in your life or three people in your life or you had two people in your life you are going to make a decision you're going to take a call and then you're going to decide with whom you want to be you're going to have a emotional heart to heart conversation and then you know a cup of love will be offered a union a partnership will be offered you're going to decide you're going to take a call and you're going to be in a relationship soon what else what else yeah like i said passionate beginning passionate beginning after a conversation heart to heart conversation passionate beginning then i have hierophant probably a person can be uh, a little traditional types an old school uh somebody who's looking for a commitment here probably that is why it took a little while for you to even decide and make a choice here or make a decision here because they are somebody who is looking uh, out for somebody not for short term but somebody they can get uh, a forever with they can get married to they can get a commitment from so it is not somebody that you will just have a fling with 
it is someone who is looking for you to give them a commitment probably a marriage or something and i feel that person has been hurt in the past and they have walked away from uh you know uh, uh from their relationship and somewhere down the line i feel that they are still uh remembering their past somewhere down the line they are still stuck in their past right they are a little sad about their loss but then yes again whatever they have walked away from their world has changed that experience has changed their world but with you they will feel a lot of at home energy because i feel uh the minute they are going to connect with you you and them you both will have abundance in life in money in love both your luck is ta taking a turn here this is a card of jupiter wherever jupiter goes it it expands that particular house so i feel with wheel of fortune both of you once you you know once you are in a relationship both of you will strive both of you will do well in your career in your finances in this particular relationship you guys will realize how a relationship is supposed to be like because you both are definitely soulmates here i see a soulmate union here happening right and you have been somehow patiently waiting for this kind of a connection all your life right so that's about it for the month of april let's see what is it that you need to let go of what is the extra messages that we have for my dear lifting for the month of april so today is the full moon let's see what do we have for my dear lifting This is for my dear lovelies. What extra messages that we have for my dear lovelies here? And full moon, full moon energies. What extra messages that we have for my dear lovelies? And full moon, or full moon. What extra messages that we have for my dear lovelies? It's time to release negativity. The end of tough cycle approaches. See, I told you, right? It's time to release negativity. The end of tough cycle is approaching. Prosperity lies ahead. As I read it out aloud to you guys, abundance is definitely coming in with this connection. it's time to release negativity with the world card and the end of tough cycle approaches with the wheel of fortune here right so this person you are connecting with and you are deciding to move ahead with this person is definitely going to bring a lot of abundance in your life and you are going to bring bring a lot of abundance in their life the tough time is ending whatever transformation that you were supposed to go through whatever clutter that you were supposed to clear from your life that will happen in the month of april and you will start afresh with this person let's see what are the messages from your person most of your mind what are the messages from your person most on your mind What are the messages from your person most on your mind, please? What are the messages from my dear listeners from your person? Oops. I feel the happiest with you. Probably you guys, when you guys talk to each other, you know they kind of find that solace from the past hurt that they have gone through in their life. I want to keep you close to my heart. They they definitely recognize this particular connection. I feel I miss you, and we have only you know me inside out. So these are the messages that we have for my dear Librans for the month of April. And thank you so much for tuning in. If you like what I do, do leave a comment in the comment section down below. 
and uh, thank you so much for tuning in any cross watchers do like share subscribe to my channel if you like what i do do leave a comment down below as well thank you so much bye bye